It's just dodging. Try not to get to four stacks. Well, you're going to get to four stacks eventually. Just don't, you know, once you get to four stacks, don't stand with your team. But yeah, that is a plus 10 two chest of Academy. I wonder if we're going to get anything good. Ooh, that is good. Yeah, what's going on, everybody? It's Mystical tonight. I am bringing you a plus 10 Academy. Now, please, first thing I want to say is if this is a low key, please tell me. Okay, I don't know what a 10 is compared to last season at all. So, please, if this is, like, too low of a level, I'm trying to aim for, like, whatever last season's 20s were. Tell me whatever whatever, rate, whatever that is. Maybe this is a tw equivalent to a 20. Either way, these are the talents I run for key zones when I'm fist weaving. Nothing really changes uh, at all from dungeon to dungeon, really. I kind of just like this, this setup. My damage is uh, mostly spinning crane kick. Zen Pulse kind of up there. Zen Pulse is insane. And then I got the Fire Axe Trinket, which I am absolutely in love with. I still need to upgrade it, but it's it's looking pretty solid. I know that the Tome of Unstable Power got nerfed. Someone also, please let me know if this Trinket is absolutely terrible. I don't know. I guess it's not terrible, right? 7% of my damage. And my healing breakdown mostly comes from, obviously, Ancient Teachings, right? Ancient Teachings. Mastery's up there because my, my gear has too much mastery on it, but I'm still trying to get good gear. Um, but, yeah, that is it for me. If you have any questions at all, please let me know. I am more than happy to answer any questions you might have. And that is it for me. Hope everyone's a fantastic rest of the day. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you later. Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is Mystical. This is a... Listen, I don't know <laughs> what level this is compared to last season this is a plus 10 academy i genuinely do not know like if if this is if this of plus 10 is lower than like a 20 of last season please let me know um because yeah i i, I honestly i genuinely don't know but I, I we were a few weeks into the season and like i didn't even know there was a squish until like two weeks in so yeah, I just thought I was getting declined from plus threes because, like, everyone wanted, like, I don't know. I've, so, yeah, please. Um, if this is if this is not a good level to, like, put Keystone videos, like, please let me know. Um, my weak aura is covering my tank's health, so let's try to hopefully not have him die and have to move that weak aura. I did get the Ray Charge Ring, though. I really like the, uh, what's it called, the Boolean um, currency. Love it. I freaking love it. I, I love that as a keystoner, you know, or someone who does keystones more than raids, you know, I don't raid anymore. Um, I love that you can buy gear, right? Like I couldn't, I, I would have never gotten the raid charge trinket if, uh, if it wasn't for the currency. So it's pretty cool. Um, right here, this is a pretty big pull. Um, it is Fort week. So props to my tank for, uh, pulling everything, the kahunis to pull it all. A lot of tanks are a little scared. Um, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm, if this tank, if this, uh, if this friend goes well, I'll probably add this tank because I don't think that's an easy, and of course this could be a lower key compared to what I think, but I don't think that was like an easy pull. So I'm going to go, go team. I'm rooting for us now. Um, this, this dungeon's fairly straightforward. It's literally like, it, no joke. You could probably do this dungeon in like three or four trash, three or four trash pulls. Like, I guess I'm not needed. Um, I guess he was looking for his dispel. So this afflicted. So, oh my god, 2.2 .2 million damage. Rain of Fire kind of cranks. I guess they, they changed it to, um, I think there was a bug at the start of the season where you couldn't, like, I don't know, Rain of Fire, which just wasn't working for Warlock, so. Um, anyway, I'm just rambling. This tank, this, uh, I, I'm still trying to catch up on mechanics for these bosses. I think we need to, obviously, we just, I think, obviously, we need to stack. Um, and then, I think we need to dodge this. Ideally, you run in the same direction but we did not run in the same direction so there's that i'm gonna use my fire right trinket oh, i love it i love that you can use it i love it dodge this and then it's gonna spawn an ad and you want to interrupt this ad you want to kill this ad asap um we all have a debuff we need to kill it uh nice dispel dispel that i'm gonna do a little shaylin's gift here good and then you stand in the green and it's gonna get rid of this debuff the debuff's gonna go away perfect um, I don't know what happens if these stay alive, though. I'm going to keep it real here. I'm hoping this Hungry Lasher isn't the reason we wipe, but it could be. I'm not sure. Yeah, it does quite a bit of damage. Um, I'm just going to sweep everything here and so, just spin the wind straight up. We're just spinning away. I'm going to do a little chi burst here. I'm going to dispel this. Throw an envelope miss on my tank, and then I'm going to do a little chi burst on it. 
get some damage going out. I feel like I'm cranking damage right now. Feels pretty good. Um, stack. Are we stacked? Uh, no. No, we're not. That's okay. That's all right. I'll cocoon the priest. I don't want him to disperse. I just want to do damage. And uh, I'm just going to keep going, I think. I think this is one of the easier dungeons. This is like a you know, fairly straightforward dungeon. Boss fights aren't terrible either, so that's kind of nice. Shaylin's gift here. Uh, we do need to... Oh, good silence from the priest. I'll dispel this afflicted. And then we do want to uh, interrupt this oh, insane damage coming out from my team. So I don't mind that. All right, good. Yeah, and then hopefully I would like to push Keystone as well um, as the season goes on. Usually at the start of the season, I try to uh, I try to learn the mechanics. You know, I'm not... I mean, I'll push keys, right? I, did, I think I did 27, a few 27s last season. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, but I would like to push as high as I can. I don't know what the highest key is now. Like, so, you know, I guess we'll see. You know, I got 19 stacks of mana. I'm kind of thirsty now. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to play this mob. Listen, this mob, I'm not messing around. Deadly wins. Don't stand. Don't get hit by it. It is, believe it or not, it is deadly. And then with this, you don't actually need to run out of the circle. You can just stand LOS and you're fine. So you don't need to do the huge run. Um, I used to think you had to. Uh, but we are fisting and there's a tornado right there. I just don't want to die. Deadly winds. I'm not trying to I'm not trying to embarrass myself. Third involvement here though. Do a little chi burst, boom. But yeah, during expel intruders, you don't need to be like far away. You don't need to be out of the circle. You can just Oh, I thought, I thought that was a tornado spawning. Spell this. Um, and then, yeah, clearly we're fist weaving. I did some cast the keys too. I think cast is decent as well. I know there's a few people that, you know, you know cast from mist weavers represent, baby. I did cast a few keys. Feels good. Obviously, it isn't nearly as much damage as fist weaving, but it is what it is. Um, definitely oom a lot more too. I'm going to drink super quick. I actually don't know how our mage died. <laughs> I have no idea how our mage died. Um, but that's okay. We're going to use our fire egg trinket here. I get a little excited. The, the damage breakdown at the end is hilarious. Like, fire egg's like, I spin to win for sure, but fire egg is like, it's just a passive damage. And it's not even fully upgraded yet either. It's only 502, so it has a lot of room for upgrades. Um, and of course, if you want to see any Keystone videos, uh, please let me know. Um, I feel like a lot of people actually enjoy Keystones. I enjoy do doing Keystones. I don't actually have nameplates up for the minion, <laughs> the minion mobs, so I don't actually see their nameplates. But uh, Gust, don't stand in front of the frontal. And I think there's something else for these. Yeah, call the flock. So I kick that, um, unless someone else is faster, of course. Dispel the afflicted. Um, Shadow priests can dispel afflicted. I think I believe that bears can dispel poisons. I do remember doing a quest for poison to spell way back in like vanilla. So I do remember that being a thing. I'm pretty sure they still have it. I don't know if tanks have it, but I know druids have it. Um, but yeah, yeah, we're doing pretty good. I don't, and, you know, and of course, you know, if this is, if this is, if this is a good keystone video for people, let me know. Um, if it's too low, <laughs> please let me know. <laughs> like, I want to know. I can, I can always. You know, get better, get better gear, and do higher keys for people that are maybe more enjoyable. Dispel that. Uh, I think someone kicked called a flock. Oh, that was actually me. So that's good. Good on, good on our Miss Weaver for landing a kick. A little bit different from PvP. <laughs> um, yeah, Fyric. I don't know what to do if it's like. Obviously, it's more AOE damage, but I guess it's, maybe it's decent for single target. I mean, damage is damage, so I'm probably just going to pop it on this boss fight, to be honest. I think I just pop it on this boss fight, and uh, where are the balls? Everyone have a ball? Okay. Firestorming dodge us. So, yeah, this boss <clears throat> has... This boss is interesting because there's, like, a few mechanics that you can choose between. I think we gonna, are going to go... I think people go Firestorm first, which is what you just saw. Um, you kind of put balls in, in the circle, and then... The boss gets stunned, takes more damage, and, you know, you kind of get... Uh, the Screech is AoE damage, so I, I chi you before it. You know, get a little absorption shield on everybody, and then uh, dodge the frontal, the overpowering gust. I'm going to dodge that as much as you can. Uh, Savage Pack is a tank mechanic. Um, I think it stacks. Yeah, it stacks. I don't know. 
how often it stacks though. So just, I don't know. So there's gonna be a situation. This right here is gonna be AOE damage. So I just normally just revival it. And then I throw the ball in here and boom. Um, I guess no one, I don't know if we're waiting or they really just want me to do it. I'm not sure, but I'll do it. I have no problem doing it. You know, it's just you know, my damage, man. All right, here we go. All right, someone else did it. Someone help me out. All right. So the boss is going to get stunned. He's going to take a ton of damage right now. If we had less, we'd press it right now. We don't. And then we're just going to do much, uh, as much damage as we can. And then as a result of us stunning him, uh, fire is going to spawn. So spread out here for this mechanic. Deafening Screech as well. Be careful. Okay. Um, I'm assuming we probably want the tornadoes as well. I mean, we don't have to, but... Oh, that's just... So there's a second mechanic. I think it takes more damage. But, I mean, why not, right? I'm going to go for a little shit. Oh, I got kicked by that. Oh my god, I'm terrible. Shaylin's gift here. All right. All right, we should be... All right. GG here. Big damage. Okay. Maybe that was dumb. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying. This is like the third 10 I've done this season, so... So trying to learn. I don't actually know what the Gus does, so maybe that was dumb. <laughs> That's okay. Go team. That's a long boss fight though. Holy cow. <clears throat> do I need uh did I have to do the second balls or is fire just enough? I don't know. Let me let me add. I mean these people seem pretty solid. I mean maybe the hands might go problem not. Okay. Alright, they seem to know. With lock damage. But I always do. All right. So normally they normally do two, but I guess fire is just enough. All right. Well. Oh, this this guy's running the fire action again. Hell yeah, I'm gonna run fire with you, brother. Sweep here. That's a lot of uh damage though. A little uh, dodge a frontal there, and we're gonna Shaylin's gift here, or sorry, um, Zen pulse into some chi burst here. We're gonna do as much damage as we can. The fire track, the fire trinket gives you a like a huge shield. So while it's up, you really, I mean, don't get hit by mechanics, but <laughs> you could. Shaylin's gift here, ambush, dodging. Don't want to stand next to him. Dodge the frontal. I'm really hoping no one gets hit by it. Make my life a little easier. I can manatee here. Splat. That's perfect <laughs> description of what just happened. But you can see how this dungeon is literally like one big pull by the tree boss few small pulls and this is what our third pull and we're already at like 50 percent. and we could if we were good if my team was insane we could oh okay calm down calm down i always like to start with the zen pulls. i love zen pulls. i'm gonna meld this oh i thought it was on me uh shaylin's gift here of course um like if we were insane or you know you watch the mdi they probably pull this whole 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 bridge with like you know lust or whatever like we have hero right now we could probably if we were coordinated we could pull into like the next boss but we're not i'm going to defuse my uh dampen harm here uh just i thought i saw something in cast on me these weak horrors are kind of freaking me out a bit though it's like too much information for me um i kind of like that just the one in the middle of the screen and like the other ones are kind of freaking me out a little bit that's what you get for blindly importing a weak or string <laughs> so I wouldn't recommend. Um, I don't know what we're doing right now. Okay. I'll fire rack trinket here because I saw a mechanic on me. I wasn't sure how much damage it was going to do. I'm going to be quite honest with you. Um, but we seem fine. Zen pulse here for damage. Just literally spin the wind. Um, if I see my tanking a little low, I'll probably... I see surge on me. I'm going to defuse magic it. Um, if I see my tank getting a little low, I'll cocoon, but... I feel like bear tanks are pretty solid. I mean, they're not, you know, everyone said that demon hunter tanks are insane, but I, I think I've, I've had success with pretty much every tank. I've had like arms or arms, prop warriors and all that, you know, a lot of bear druids, a lot of bears. Okay. 
Watch him just die instantly now. <laughs> nice, nice. We're doing good. Kick that. Good. Chi burst here. Throwing about Miss Digger. Throwing about Miss There. We're going to extend those hots with our Rising Sun Kick. Tiger Palm. Blackout Kick. Rising Sun Kick. But yeah, I would love to do more Keystones. Keystones are something I... You know, if there's no arena, a mob remix just came out. I actually just leveled something to 70. So if anyone, any levelers out there, shout out to you guys. Um, I'm gonna kick in this. Um, but keystones are something. If no one else is around, I kind of just enjoy. Just do, doing some keys. I just love it. I freaking love doing keys. I think they're so much fun. Hopefully, I can find like a decent team one of these days. You know, like a a main team be kind of nice it's hard though it's hard to find people maybe i'm like i'll add these people these this these three from area 52 like came in like a, i just invited them because it was fastest <laughs> you know what i mean uh where am I, where's my health stone but they're actually like insane all right okay so arcane orbs uh you don't want them to hit the boss pretty pretty simple um you could revival them if you want just i tried to spell if like there's a few stacks or you know off cooldown essentially because they're magic you're the only one that can really that can dispel it um i'm gonna try to dispel actually i didn't have to dispel myself there because i actually have diffuse magic i'm gonna diffuse magic now though and i'm gonna soak this and then i'm going to if i see too many stacks going out like maybe on the tank or on dps i will uh i throw a revival out just because there really isn't much of a need for revival for like the next part of the dungeon but I'm just going to revival here, actually. Why not? I'm not sure how much damage uh, soaking these orbs would do. All right. I'm going to uh, dampen harm here. Shade Loon's gift here. Dispel. I'm just going to use fire rack. Why not? Big damage. Get an absorption shield to myself. Manatee here. Throw a Shade Loon's gift. Or, sorry, Jade Fire Stomp. Shade Loon's gift only has three stacks right now. So it's like a little weird. Not really good use there. I'm going to dispel the tanks. I feel like tanks most important. Throw an envelope mist here. Good. Throw a Shaylun. Jade fire stomp. I keep calling it Feline stomp. Right. Of course, when I learn how to actually pronounce it right, they change it. How dare they? Nice. Good job from the tank moving the uh, frontal. And we are good. Yeah. Boss isn't too too scary. And this is we're doing insane on time. So I don't know what we're going to do now. I don't know if we're going to invis skip. I don't know because we have to cross the bridge, go to the last boss. Nope, we're just pulling it. All right, you love to see that. Of course, of course. I'm just going to four here because I'm actually a little scared. And I feel like he wants to pull into the next, you know, pack. But, I don't, oh, oh, okay. Yo, calm down, calm down. Didn't see it. Sorry, sorry. Sweep everything. Yeah, he really wants to pull into the next, uh, oh. The next pack so it looks like that's what we're gonna do but be careful because this mob doesn't move like with this frontal so it's always a little scary i feel like we should be okay though it's a pretty big pull though pretty big pull i wish i had my fire rack 10 seconds big damage i'm gonna chiji here should she burst first i think she burst Ooh. Ooh. i felt that one i felt that one for sure all right we're gonna fire rack here we should be able to live we should have some damage now and we're just gonna crank that's the plan just crank as much damage as we can. Ooh. That's okay. That's all right. If I see anything being cast on me, I'm just gonna. I'm instantly melding it. I'm gonna cocoon you, my mage. Okay. Throw a little envelopment mist here. The heal here. I got send pulse into a Shaylun's gift. Pretty solid heal there. I wonder if I should Shaylun's gift into a Zen pulse instead of the other way around because then you get the uh, like benefit from uh the buff you get spell here i have nothing for you my friend i'm sorry i'm gonna i'm gonna spot heal him but i got i'm, I'm gonna hard cast here but i'm not gonna like it okay good good Ooh, oh my, i just accidentally taunted that guy off my tank because it's reflex from pvp like, usually when someone's taking damage and there's, like, a bunch of pets, I try to taunt something. Oh, my God. I'm happy I've Shadow Mold. I will never not be Night Elf just before that reason. Why do I even have... Why do I even have taunt keybound when I'm PvEing? Who knows why? I don't. <laughs> um, and then this is the last part of Dungeon right here. We have the stairs open up from the first boss. 
Um, we're probably not going to three chest this, but decent chance at two chesting. Um, so that's pretty good. Kind of like that. I'm interested to see how much my fabric. I love seeing how much damage the fire trinket does because it, it's like a toy you weren't able to have before. You know, like I couldn't, I literally couldn't get it before. And now I have access to like the best trinket in the game. I'm so happy. Does Rop interrupt? Last season, Rop, these people chased you last time, didn't they? I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure last season these mobs chased you. Because I remember Ring of Peace and like making them not able to hit my team. But they could have changed it. They've made some changes going to the final season, so that's pretty good. Um, I don't know if we're just eating that whirlwind or if he's just not taking damage from it. I can't tell which. Pretty chill though. Pretty chill. Good. Uh, might might use cocoon here. It is raging. I'm just gonna cocoon him. I'm gonna. I don't have any other use for cocoon, right? Like, all right. We got some pretty good trash too. I get Todd here. Why not? We're at 91. percent I don't know if we double pull here. I don't know if there's an easier pull that we do, but we're probably gonna pull. Oh, okay. I don't. I don't have cooldowns, so. All right, we should probably pull into here. Perfect. Good. We're going to LOS here. I'm going to just dampen harm here just because I'm a little scared uh, for myself. I'm loving the pings. I love these pings. Four leaves. I love four leaves. Loving it. Loving it. I think, ping, I think adding pings to the game is one of the best things they've ever added. Straight up. All right. And now we're just going to Chigi here. I'm just going to Chigi and, and spin and then rock out kick for the... Instant enveloping mist, and we're just gonna keep spinning. Blackout kick, because there's so many people stacked up that your black that your tiger palm, it literally it should get enveloping mist instantly. So, uh, we'll just fire here. Why not? Oh, sorry. Oh, I thought he was gonna die. I didn't really have anything. I mean, if I don't have cocoon or like, I guess I had revival, but I don't know if I'm, am I really gonna use. Them? I don't know. I guess probably would. Yeah, I'm the healer. Like it's my role to uh, do whatever I can <laughs> to keep the the team alive. All right, I'll drink here. I don't need the mana. I have five sacks of mana. Tea and oh, this boss isn't too bad. Okay, so this boss has a pretty interesting mechanic. Um, and feel free to correct me if I'm wrong because I've done this boss only a few times. Um, if you get hit by a mechanic, you get a stack. You get a debuff at three. De at three. So energy, ener energy bomb. Okay, this guy's gonna get a like a stack of the mechanic and you want to not get hit by it if you get to three stacks i think you put a pool on the ground i'm pretty sure um but what's interesting is these balls actually give you a damage increase so i ran into that ball yeah i ran into it on purpose okay i'm gonna defuse magic this um oh sorry it's a four stacks it's four stacks and i have a temper i have a 15 percent damage increase and if i don't get hit by any mechanics i keep that that damage buff so you can see like 15 percent damage increased it's pretty cool but if you're gonna get to your fourth stack like you want to obviously run away because you're gonna put a pool on the ground if you do that so if i got hit by this breath i, I would spell this oh something in me you don't want to be stacked for that manatee here uh just a spell why not Good. I was gonna throw a Shaylin's gift out, uh, just for the buff. Dodge. It's a frontal. Just don't stand in front. Dodge this. Fire Act trinket. Also gives you a, a huge absorption shield, by the way. Let's go cocoon the mage, cause why not? I think he's frost, so I don't want an ice block. Um, I'm just gonna ooh. spell here. Put a pull down, cause I'm bad. I rolled into it. It's my fault. Can I, just, can I just finesse my way in? Yeah, just don't mind me. It's just dodging. Trying not to get to four stacks. Well, you're going to get to four stacks eventually. Just don't, you know, once you get to four stacks, don't stand with your team. But yeah, that is a plus 10 two chest of Academy. I wonder if we're going to get anything good. Ooh, that is good.